we just finished up the 2020 season and now we're getting ready to drive 500 miles up the coast from San Diego to Big Sur. It's going to be really cool to just see these new places, figure out our favorite spots along the way. Looking forward to getting started and getting on the road. This morning we woke up at San Onofre um, State Beach. Uh, we woke up to uh, some waves crashing, which is cool. Our campsite was right on the ocean. What are we doing today or how are we doing today? Today we're serving church, which is a break, uh, just north of San Onofre campsite. Um, so we're just getting the boards ready to go, re-waxed, coffee's made. Now it's just getting Morgan out of bed. I'm Morgan Hackworth. I'm a wingback slash midfielder for San Diego Loyal. Ever since I was a kid, um, I grew up surfing and always dreamed of doing a drive up the coast. Starting off in San Diego and heading up to Big Sur. Just super excited. I wake up in my car and he's knocking on the glass at 5.25 in the morning. We get out in the water early, and then... Catastrophe strike. Catastrophe, your board gets absolutely wrecked by a surfer. We made up for the catastrophic event with yeah. a fantastic breakfast. We gotta roll with the punches. We might try and get a new board or get this fixed. Yeah, we're going to the surf shop. Going to the surf shop, going to the surf shop. Morgan's gonna buy a surfboard because he broke his. Because he's a kook. When things in life break, sometimes you gotta put them away and get a fresh new one. This is my new baby, the OG Flyer by Channel Islands. We gotta wax this thing up. Get it out there. say servants like soccer. I think they're different. One is sort of an outlet from soccer, but there's a lot of creativity in both. And every time you get on the water, just like every time you play, it's never the same and you kind of don't know what you're gonna get into. And that's sort of what makes every session out in the water so exciting, just like every game. Strand. Today we surfed right up here by the campsite. We woke up to 25 to 30 miles per hour winds. Should we go wake up Morgan? Rise and shine, baby. The surf was bigger today than it was the whole trip, which yeah. was awesome. 
was super clean out there, three to four north northwest swell. Yeah, the, wave, the waves held up well. It was cold. It was water spraying everywhere. I think it's pretty important to remember that we're soccer players first, not surfers. <laughs> what is that? Not me. Not me. Does it look cool with the smoke or no? We're just south now of Big Sur. So we're really looking forward to getting up north. Getting into some redwood country. I'm Ben Spencer, I play forward for San Diego Loyal. I came into San Diego a bit late. Uh, I joined the team halfway through the season. Landon gave me a call and asked if I wanted to join the team and it was a really easy yes to come to San Diego and, and live in such a great place and join a great organization with some great coaches was really attractive to me and I jumped at the opportunity and I was just Really fortunate to, to be given the chance to play here, and I'm really excited to see what the future holds with um, San Diego Loyal. The, the, sh the shortened season made everything just feel weird, and it made the season come to an end really quickly, um, especially with what happened in our last two games um, with the comments made to two of our players. So there was a lot going on off the field, which was a little bit different than, than normal. So you're not just focusing on you know, who, you, who you're playing next, um, but we're kind of then fighting a, a larger issue. So obviously we didn't make the playoffs, which was disappointing, but what was really something to be proud of was the statements that we made as a club and as an organization that um, really the world heard about. Um, so I think despite not making the playoffs, I think we have a lot to be proud of from from the first year and it's a great building year um, moving forward into year two. Yeah, so this was a roller coaster of a year. Uh, a lot of ups and downs on and off the field, but um, I'm so proud to be a part of San Diego Loyal. I love the city of San Diego. Uh, I love the people there, the locals. Um, the fan base that we have there is really special and super supportive of our team. Every battle that we're going through, it feels like our supporters are right behind us. Uh, and that's a special feeling to have in the USL. So it means a lot. looking forward to about 2021 is getting back in front of our fans. I'm keeping my fingers crossed for a season without complications, with good health. Playing games in full stadiums again, that was something I think we all missed in 2020. And hopefully a lot of success for San Diego Loyal.